we in NYC right now. Six o'clock in the morning, I like getting up early, so we're gonna do some conditioning drills. These are drills that I like doing, you know, on a weekly basis, today's conditioning. So you're gonna see drills that's actually gonna translate to the game. All right, next drill, we're gonna work acceleration along with big change of direction. So I call this acceleration pivot drill. So all we're gonna do here, boom, step, step, sprinting, sprint, boom, inside whip, curves run, finishing through. Now this is a very advanced drill, all right? So slowly work your way to it, work your way up to it if you need to. But hey, let's get to work. Same thing, moving the arms, accelerate, right? No wasted movements. Let's work this footwork. I'm telling y'all, man, do these drills. These drills is actually gonna get you better and translate to the game, all right? So ignore all that other stuff you see. Follow my drills, trust me. You will get better, guaranteed. All right, so let's work. Rep number one, we are gonna work pivot into the right, pivot to the right. That pivot turn, that pivot turn ain't no joke. <laughs> Hey, I felt it right there. I definitely got to work on that. But hey, look all right, though. But that's what I'm saying. Even me, you got to stay attention to that technique. All right. Keep those arms moving. Stay low. Fire out. Finish through. Okay, so the first rep, I like going high speed, working the technique. Second rep, boom. Now I'm going full speed, full speed, including the arms in it. There we go. Boom. Y'all get back again. Y'all get back again. So it's important. When you're doing conditioning, you gotta push yourself. So I could be one of those athletes that walk back. Today ain't one of them days. Today, I gotta get that working. So we jog it back. Then we take around two to three minutes of rest in between each rep, but y'all get back. Always gotta hustle on the field, all right? That's just integrity. Have standards for yourself, right? Don't be lazy, we out here working. We trying to get better. Run back, because in a game after a play, you gotta run back to the huddle. So that's what we working on. On to the next. We're on, working on staying on this line as close as we can. It's cool to veer off a little bit, stay as close as you can, and practice accelerating while maintaining that body control, all right? Let's work. Same thing, jog it back, jog it back. We hustling today, we working, we hustling. All right, so there you guys see it. I did a crossover run for about 10, 15 yards, then turn and go. That's it, simple like that. Maintain that low control. Once again, body control. This drill don't be too much in a hurry, but we wanna be fast, on to the next. If y'all know me, you know we are gonna finish off with some sprints, so we are gonna go drop step sprints. Now, people, athletes ask me, how can you get faster? The best way to get faster, there's a lot of drills and exercises that you can do, but the best way to get faster is running full speed, all right? But not just linear, you gotta work from this direction. Sometimes you may have to work a shuffle and run. All things that you gotta do in your sport. So today we're gonna work drop step runs. So we're here, say go, boom, turn and run. That's it. So turn and run, stay low. We got two reps each side. We're gonna work turning to the left. Let's work. Oh yeah. We working today. Jog it back. So that's it. Practice doing that. You wanna get faster? Come out here to the field and run. You don't need no equipment. Just run, 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 full speed.